Los Angeles International Airport and Long Beach Airport will receive grants as part of a $1 billion national program funding 85 airports nationwide under President Joe Biden's bipartisan infrastructure law, the White House announced on Thursday, July 7. The grants are to be used to expand airport terminals, increase energy efficiency, promote competition and provide greater accessibility for individuals with disabilities, according to a release from the White House press office. Americans deserve modern airports that meet the needs of their family. Funded through President Biden's bipartisan infrastructure law, today's grants will improve airport terminals while also creating good jobs in communities across the country. Buttigieg is set to visit Los Angeles Thursday and Friday to discuss various infrastructure projects and tout Biden's bipartisan infrastructure law. LAX will receive $50 million to reconstruct and modernize the terminal roadway system, including reconfiguring the LAX CDA entrance. Long Beach Airport will receive $10. $6 million to reconstruct terminal roadways, realign the terminal loop and establish ADA accessibility. The work that goes into build safer, more accessible and sustainable terminals will provide opportunities for people across the nation, FAA Deputy Administrator Ray Bradley Mims said in a statement. The bipartisan infrastructure law is a critical investment not only in our nation's infrastructure, but an investment in the future of our country's workforce. Both LAX and Long Beach have undertaken modernization and renovation efforts in recent years, work that remains ongoing. The Los Angeles airport is in the middle of a $15 billion, multi-phase modernization program, with a night toward the 2028 Summer Olympics in Los Angeles. Los Angeles will also be a host city for the 2026 World Cup. In March, LAX and Delta officials unveiled the first phase of a multi-billion dollar makeover of Terminals 2 and 3, a four-level, 770,000 square foot building in which departing passengers will find fine ticketing and check-in, security screening, and baggage claim in one place. That facility is part of a much broader reimagining of the terminals. Last fall, a $294 million, 1, 7 million square foot economy parking facility opened with 4, 300 new parking spots. Other recent improvements include a $477, 5 million, 283,000 square foot extension of Terminal 1 and the opening of the west gates of the Tom Bradley Terminal, a $1, 73 billion project that added 15 gates and 750,000 square feet just west of the Bradley Terminal. LAX is also working on its automated people mover, the centerpiece of the airport's modernization program, which will have six total stations, three inside the central terminal area and three outside the CTA. The People Mover will connect the train system to Metro Rail and bus lines and a car rental facility. 